Okay, this is my kitchen. It's pretty dirty. Let's clean it up together. I have all of these things out because I was baking some muffins. Oatmeal muffins. Alright, now let's get into it. The first thing I need to do is put everything away. I only have 10 minutes. Okay, so I'm going to put everything in the sink first. I keep things in bins to keep them organized. And if they spill, they spill into the bins, not my pantry. This is my all-purpose flour. I would like a bin for the all-purpose flour, but I don't have one yet. This is how I recycle. I wash all of the containers and put it into the recycle bin. get recycled. Then I throw trash away and I put everything away that I can. all-purpose cleaner. It's hydrogen peroxide, a little bit of dish soap, and water. I fold it in fours so I can use the other side of the rag. Sometimes I have to rinse out the rag again. I can use the other side. dirty. You may think this is gross. I use a sponge, some dish soap, and I rinse everything off, and then I dry everything and put it away. Some people call themselves germaphobes and don't like this method. I'm sorry if you're watching. I'm not a germaphobe.
I use the compost bin. Now I'm washing everything in my cleaning caddy. While I'm at it, I'll wash my cleaning caddy too. I'm using a magic eraser. I use these burp cloths. They're also reusable diapers to dry everything. Don't worry, they're clean. I reuse them over and over and over again. I don't need paper towels or disposable wipes. To clean the sink, I'm using the magic eraser and dish soap. Now I have a clean, dry cloth and I'm going to dry everything and put it away. If you're liking this video so far, give it a thumbs up. like videos like these, be sure to subscribe.
Hey, thanks so much for watching. I hope you liked the video. This is the after. And remember how unorganized it was? How many things I had to put away? And now it feels so fresh. My sink was a disarray. My counter. And now look at it. See you later.